guys. So I've been in the fitness industry for a while now and I've gotten a little bit stronger and I know you have too. And I bet you've been wondering, how can I show off more at the gym? I know a lot of my friends on Instagram have found ways and I just thought you guys might want to know. So today I'm going to share with you some ways that you can show off at the gym too. Wear as little clothing as possible. Shirts, never. Shorts, tight and little. This way, people are sure to see all of your curves. Next, impress them with your hardest moves. So I've been working really hard at some of these moves, and one of the hardest ones is the dive bomber. Now this video is kind of a joke, and I know you guys can tell that I'm being sarcastic, but for real, this move is a killer. So you're gonna start in a kind of an upside down V, like a downward dog, and you're gonna come down into a dive bomber push up, look up, and then you're gonna reverse the direction. That's where actually the hard work is. So push back and come on up. So if you can do this move at the gym, you're bound to get some guys that are very impressed. And guys, you can do this too to impress the ladies. Although I'm not gonna lie, we don't really care nearly as much. Now my next tip I see a lot on my Instagram feed. Make sure you bring a buddy to take pictures and videos of your workouts at the gym so you can brag about it all on Instagram or Facebook. Because if you don't have a picture of it, no one actually believes that you were there or you did it. Next, you gotta impress them again with a really hard move. Because even if you have your friend there taking video, you actually have to show us like something that's really hard. So I want you guys to try this move. It's rolling like a ball with a pistol squat. So you're gonna start at the top of your mat you're gonna come on down. You're gonna give me a nice little roll like a ball. You gotta get a little bit of momentum, let's go. And then you're gonna do a pistol squat on up. Then you come back down, do it again on the other foot. This time with the right. Oh, and there we go. But really, go and try that move, it's hard, and if you can do it, you feel a lot better about yourself and you will be sore. The next tip is to never go to the gym with a fresh face. You always wanna have makeup on so you're ready for selfies or to maybe run into your future husband. Everyone takes selfies these days. You have to look your best in order to really stand out. To stand out at the gym, make sure you've got a nice flex going, maybe a piece of equipment, and that phone in the shot. Serious face, never smiling. And the last one for all you yogis out there or people that just wanna be a yogi or can do one cool yoga move and that's it, like me. This move is gonna impress everybody at the gym and get you more attention, even in your yoga class. So you're gonna come on down into a yoga headstand to really cool it down. You're gonna place your hands in a nice praying position, your elbows in line with your shoulders. You're gonna flip upside down, cup your head, walk those feet in until your hips are in line with your shoulders, and then slowly, one at a time. I've never done this talking before. Let's go, there we go. And there you have it, a nice headstand for your cool down. Let all the blood drip down into your head. If you want to get a little provocative, you could even do a little bit of a split. Forward and back. So if you've been looking for ways to show off more at the gym, hopefully I've given you a few new moves to try out and also techniques to make sure that your social media is in tip top shape for attracting some hot followers and also maybe even meeting your future husband. If you have some tips on how to show off at the gym, let me know down below. And if you're still watching and you think that I'm being completely serious in this video, I'm not. But these three moves are really hard and I challenge you guys to try them. See you soon.